I'm Jason. I work at Edit LLC, but for 59 Days of Code, I'm participating in a project called Chrome DJ. It's uh, really a mix of two ideas. Uh, my coworker was talking about technology in Chrome allowing us to do what is basically multicast technology, which is you know, one person being able to stream to multiple clients at the same time. Uh, and so that's like pretty cool technology. He would wanted to do perhaps like a chat room in the browser, which I was like, well, we have plenty of chat rooms. Uh, but we both like this one product called uh, Turntable FM, which allowed um, a person to host a chat room and sort of DJ out music to you know people in the chat room. The problem was that at the time you couldn't do like peer-to-peer -peer streaming in the browser, so the product was too expensive to maintain and it shut down. What excites us is that you know browser technology keeps accelerating and now we're able to do this sort of peer-to-peer -peer streaming which wasn't possible before. It's taking advantage of you know, things that didn't exist like a year ago. We really want to be able to do peer-to-peer -peer streaming just in the browser. Eventually even toss away the server component. There's a lot of reasons to want to do this. Uh, one is lower cost of overhead. The fewer servers we have to maintain, the less we'll have to extract from the, you know, the ecosystem that we're trying to build. Another is, you know, even for legal reasons, if the bits of music never touch our server and it's purely, you know, a person-to-person -person interaction, then the burden of legality, I hope, you know, uh, is transferred a little bit to the actual users. We just want, you know, two people who know each other um, to be able to stream music to each other. I mean, I'm really in it for learning the new technology. I don't know if this particular project itself will become anything big, but I am convinced that the technology in it uh, will be big in the future.